Parmalee is unique in the fact that we have two communities. We have Global Village and the Arts and Creative Expressions community. Every time you walk through the hall, there's always a creative vibe. And then we have Global Village, which is made up of students from all over the world. Walking through the hallways, you'll hear different languages just every day. You're sitting here talking to someone. There's like three people in the background talking in Russian, two people here talking in Spanish. I probably don't know the benefits of it now or like how cool it is right now, but back in Saudi, we only one language all the time. In Parmalee here, we have sweet style rooms, which means you get your own sink and mirror inside your own room. That also means your bathroom is connected to the room next door to you, so you get to know someone else in your hall really well. Every floor has a quiet study, study room and kind of a loud common lounge. Whenever I feel like just sitting in my room, I just go there and listen to music. <laughs> Pink Floyd, <laughs> that's, that's really what, pretty much all I listen to. One of the coolest places here in Parmalee is the Parmalee Lobby. We have ping pong tables and pool tables, and you can check out games from the front desk. Every time you go there, you either find people watching a football game, sometimes they hold movie nights over there. The dining center here in Parmalee is inside, so you don't have to go outside for any of your meals, and it's also attached to Corbett, so you can pick from two dining centers. Parmalee Hall is a is set in a really convenient location because it's close to the rec center. Like I go there every Monday, Wednesday, Friday to play soccer. Parmalee is really close to Rockwell Hall, which is great if you're a business major. We're also it's really close to Old Town. It's like a 10 minute walk from here. You get to meet a lot of diverse people. I never got to see when I was back in Saudi, like people with nose rings, new hairstyles that I've never seen before. It's pretty cool. Before I came here, I thought that Colorado, like everyone would be riding trucks. Honestly, this is but this was my perception. Everyone liked trucks. It's intercountry music all the time, you know what I mean? But when I came here, it was like totally different. It's just the feel of the city feels homey, and that really has to do with just like the people here are, are just so so accepting and so friendly. It's really nice having the mountains close by. My hall and I bonded with each other in the beginning of the year by hiking 14ers every other weekend. And those are pretty challenging, so once you do that with people you just met, it creates a friendship. Well, I come from a city, and we don't do anything outdoors. But just being surrounded by people who love to go to hike, or go to ski, I've, I've done my fair share of like, you know, hiking and, and snow hiking or s snowshoeing and camping a couple of times and I loved them. When I came to the US, I thought I'd have a lot of close international friends. I definitely didn't expect that I would have really close American friends, but now I have my best friends that are American. Every now and then they're like, oh man, I've never imagined in my life that I'd have a Saudi friend that I can call my, you know, my close friend. It's a learning experience for everyone. <laughs> it's a great thing to be a part of. Don't be afraid to come to college just because you think you, you wouldn't fit. Because college is so different than high school. You can be the person who you want to be here and you, you'll find people who will accept you no matter who you are.